myself Deepika. In previous video, we have discussed the one-person company in case you want to start up your business as a one person. So you can check out my previous video. Uh, in this video, we are going to discuss uh, public limited company. So what is a public limited company? A public limited company is a famous form of uh, limited liability uh, form of ownership. Uh, a minimum number of persons required to incorporate the and uh, operate a public uh, limited company is seven. And uh, unique feature of uh, uh, public limited company like limited liability of uh, the shareholder and uh, ability to raise uh, equity fund separate legal entity and perpetual succession make it uh, the most recommended type of business entity for millions of uh, um, small and medium sized business that are professionally uh, managed. So uh, now let's discuss the features of uh, a public limited company. So uh, if we talk about separate legal entity, uh, a public limited, uh, limited company is a separate legal uh, entity from the person forming, forming it. Uh, the ownership can be uh, distinguished from its uh, management unlike uh, in other business form. Uh, a public limited company as a legal entity is capable of owning its uh, funds and other uh, properties. Next, if we uh, uh, talk about the perpetual entity, if uh, is the people uh, may come and go but the uh, company continue to live uh, on forever. So perpetual succession means that uh, the company shall continue to exist even if uh, the member dies. So the management may change but the company shall continue to exist and uh, till it's uh, wound up in accordance with the provision of the relevant laws. And uh, uh, the liability of a public limited company is not the liability of its members and uh, members are only liable for the amount they have undertaken to deposit when uh, they subscribe to the share for the company. And uh, uh, liability of the company uh, are not the liability of the people uh, forming it and uh, yeah. And uh, next is if uh, the most important, uh, if we talk about uh, raising money, so the most important advantage of a public limited company is the ability to raise share capital, particularly where the company is listed on the stock exchange. So since it uh, can sell and it, say, it shares to the public, uh, anyone is able to uh, invest their money and the capital that can be raised uh, is typically much larger than a private limited company. And uh, next feature uh, is that uh, easy transferability and in case you wish to transfer your business, you can easily do uh, this incorporated business model, model and like in case of uh, proprietorship or the traditional partnership. It, uh, it is uh, easy to sell business for a company than any other business form. So as a business corporation value will be uh, based on the business, not the owner. So therefore making uh, it easy to sell the company. Well, uh, yeah, public limited company by offering uh, shares and uh, to the public uh, given opportunity to uh, spread the risk of the company ownership uh, among a large number of shareholders. Uh, this may help the uh, promoters and uh, investors in the company to sell some of their own shares and the profit while sharing it still uh, uh, retaining. A substantial stake in the company and uh, mitigating risk. So uh, next, uh, what are the documents which are required uh, for uh, registration? So a uh, one phot uh, photograph of the member and director, self attest pen card and Aadhaar card, and your voter ID card and uh, driving license and uh, passport and uh, passport of uh, the proposed director and uh, the Aadhaar card and the PAN card uh, of your members and directors. So uh, Aadhaar card proof, electricity bill and uh, bank statement, telephone bill showing the address of the directors and uh, address proof of uh, uh, your registered office, registered office address and uh, uh, their uh, utility bill, telephone or electricity bill. So 
in return what you get after registration is uh, our digital sign uh, signature certificate of seven members and uh, a den of uh, bin of three directors and uh, memorandum of association article of association and pan of the company and dan of the company that's it for today thank you so much for coming